Chelsea has resumed negotiations with Juventus to sell Romelu Lukaku, which might result in Dusan Vlahovic joining the club at Stamford Bridge. In order to make a better offer for Lukaku, Juventus had been waiting for Paris Saint-Germain to acquire Vlahovic, but the French champions are now interested in Ausmane Dembel of Barcelona and Randall Colo Muoni of Eintracht Frankfurt. Juventus has suggested that Chelsea purchase Vlahovic for a price plus Lukaku, and the Blues are interested in the concept. They are prepared to spend an additional £21.5 million to £38.5 million on top of the exchange price to close a deal. However, as Chelsea looks to reform their pay bill, Vlahovic's salary has in the past been seen as a roadblock. It is understood that both teams are still in negotiations and there is no firm agreement on the amount Chelsea should pay. Vlahovic struggled with form and fitness at times last season, but the Blues are ready to take a bet on the striker's fitness since Mauricio Pochettino is a big fan. Vlahovic scored 10 goals in 27 appearances. After spending the previous season on loan at the San Siro, where he scored 10 goals in 25 Serie A games, Lukaku was initially rumoured to be moving back to Inter Milan this summer. After learning that the 30-year-old had concurrent negotiations with Juventus, Inter withdrew from the contest to sign him. However, when recently questioned by an Inter supporter, Lukaku indicated reservations about a transfer to their local rivals. An Inter supporter begged Lukaku in a conversation that was recorded by a TikTok user and published on Twitter, If you sign for Juve, never say come on Juve. The Belgian striker said, no no never, with a grin before adding, I don't think the deal will go through. Since Lukaku will be on the team's books permanently from 2019 to 2021 before returning on loan for the 2022-23 season, certain inter-circles see the transfer as a betrayal. Lautaro Martinez, a fellow striker, expressed disappointment with his former Inter teammate's behaviour, telling Gotzetta dello Sport. I was disappointed, it's the truth. In those chaotic times, I too tried to call him, but he never returned my calls, just like he had done with my previous pals. I was disappointed after spending so much time together and experiencing so much together. Thankfully, he can decide. I hope the best for him. However, I didn't anticipate this attitude. Lukaku was slated to go on loan to Juventus for the next campaign, but Chelsea quickly turned down the offer. The Blues want to get rid of him permanently and are prepared to sell him for as cheap as £34.2 million, which would represent a considerable loss compared to the £97.5 million they originally spent for him in 2021. The Belgian attacker does not presently practice with the Chelsea first team, and did not travel with them on their pre-season US trip.